Understanding private and public key. Let's understand what is private and public key, where you are creating with your SSH. Private and public key. This, ladies and gentlemen, it is a private key. This is a private key. Only my friend has it. At the door of his house, there is a slot which this goes into. That is a public key. If this private key and public key matches the door of GitHub opens and you can go in. So what you do, you by creating that SSH key on your computer, you create two keys that match, one private, one public. You put the public key on GitHub, you keep the private key and add it to your keychain on your computer. When your computer connects to GitHub, you are telling the computer to use that key. You are telling, if you have a PC, you are telling Tordisk Git to use that key. If you are using Mac, it automatically picks it up because it's at the right place. It picks it up, it matches it. If everything's okay, you go without any user ID and password. That's private and public key. Now, if you have three computers, or if you are on Matrix, you create another key, private key and public key on Matrix, and you copy that public key on GitHub too. So on GitHub, you have two slots, two doors to enter. One Matrix can come in, the other one, your computer can come in. And at any moment, if you want to close the door to any of these, you can go delete that public key from your GitHub and the connection is closed. Are we good with this? Do we understand what pri private and public keys are? All right. Muchas gracias, señor. All right.